Dean, our first three points on the road. Can you sum up how you're feeling after that one? Delighted with the victory. Um, I think we should have won the game much more comfortable, but no games in this division are easy. And we've created plenty of chances, which is a great positive. A bit disappointed we conceded. A good strike by the lad. But look, first and foremost, you want to win the game of football. And it's all about three points. That's what Saturdays are out, Saturday and Tuesday nights. So, you know, to pick up eight points in my last four games, it's two points per game. I'm very pleased with it. You just mentioned there, four games unbeaten now. It's great to have some momentum going forwards. Yeah, you want to build momentum, yeah. Look, we've still got a lot of teething problems. We've got a lot to get better at. You know, I felt like I watched Grimsby against Dover and they were rootless. And I can see why Grimsby are where they are. We have to get that mentality around their camp if we're going to be a successful team. Got goals for Mason Bloomfield and Daniel Powell today. What did you make of their performances? Yeah, I thought Powell, he was excellent all day. Um, Bloom still has ins and outs of his performances. He can still get better, he can still improve. But he's work in progress. He needs to see numbers better. Um, he's a big lad, a big strong lad. And his natural game is to play with back to goal, but I'd like him to see numbers better so he can run the def uh, defenders the way. And he got a goal early in the game as well, because it was disallowed. We didn't think it was offside, but it was disallowed for offside. I'm glad he got goals in the six yard box. That's where we want him to be. And uh, it was a solid performance for him. A, a first start for, for Aston Oxborough. Um, what do you make of his, uh, his, his performance? Because he made a, a few good saves there. Yeah, he had a few saves from distance to make. No real chances, I didn't feel, for Dover in clear chances. Uh, sorry, tell a lie, there was one at the back post in the second half and at 2-1. Um, but apart from that, most of the distance, he had a few crosses that he comes to get. That's what he does. Um, he's just a little bit rusty with his kick, and that's just is what it is. He's been out for a little while, but he's top goalkeeper. And we know what we have in our camp with, uh, with Oxo. Dover are fighting for, for survival already, and we showed real resilience when they got a goal back, which must be uh, encouraging to see. Yeah, look, Hess is a very experienced manager and he knows the league inside out, so it's difficult for Dover at the minute. They have a lot of injuries and we've probably caught them at the right time. So, but for us, we can only look at ourselves and how we can improve. And uh, I'm delighted with our supporters today, you know, we've given them something to sing about again. I thought we started on the front foot, like I said, we scored early and it was disallowed. And, you know, I thought it was a good, good performance and I think our scoreline should have been a little bit stronger. What, what else are you looking to see from the players then? Well, we need to be ruthless. We need to do what Grimsby did. That's the standard of this division, if we're going to kick up the division and go right up it. If we're going to perform like that around the goals, um, we won't go where, they, where the other teams are, but we want to be. So that's the, that's the real truth of it. Well, we saw the togetherness there for, from the, the players and the fans at the end. Uh, just how important is that? Yeah, we've no question that we have togetherness and we're creating that. That comes with results as well, but the lads are running their socks off. So first and foremost, I always say to them, run your socks off for yourself and your family, and that's what they've done today. So the four games I've been in charge, they've run their socks off in every game. Um, I'm just being picky to be totally honest with you and sort of saying look if we're going to get to that level where we want to be you know we need to be rootless and it's a, it's a key word really rootless and but I'm proud of our togetherness that we're creating already I support us shoot it off again we're giving something to go home uh, home with in the sense of positive uh, with the victory so we'll enjoy it tonight and uh, we'll move on to start from Monday we'll move on to Borland Woods which is going to be a great toy. Thank you Dean.